and welcome to Elevated Energetics. Today I'm going to be doing a little unboxing. I have already peeked in this, but this is a, a larger order I made from Four Directions Magic. They're located in St. Charles, Ontario, and I'll link their Facebook page um, somewhere around here where you can find and go check them out, um, especially if you're local uh, to French River area, Sudbury, Ontario, etc. They are um, they're located in St. Charles. So I just wanted to show you guys what I got. So I've been playing with Moldavite and different tectites for a while. I have Moldavite, Libyan Desert Glass, and Saphrodite on my necklace here. I haven't taken this off in like since I made it about two months ago, I think. And it's really enhanced a lot of just giving me no choice but to release old patterns that aren't serving. It's led me to make decisions I never thought I could actually make and do to start embodying like a better version of myself. So it's really helped with transformation, with just allowing me to have the courage to go after what I want and to not settle for anything less than I deserve, things like that. Lots going on in my personal life and I feel like these are just supporting me through those changes, through those transformations and helping me to see things from a higher perspective. It's a really interesting energy. I feel really at home uh, with Tektites and I just purchased three more pieces of Moldavite that I will be wrapping um, for whoever is interested in purchasing one. So I'll be putting that on necklaces and I just want to show you I know the lighting isn't the best in here but they are actually quite a good size this one here is 2.2 grams of moldavite beautiful beautiful I'll get the lighting in the background there I also have this 3.3 gram which is quite large really excited to wrap these up for whoever they are going to end up with. So yeah, that one was 3.3 grams and this one is 2.6 grams and it's very similar size to the 3.3 gram. I just like the large, large surface area here. And please ignore <laughs> these tattoos. They need to be touched up. That's okay. They look a little funny right now. I'm just waiting for them to finish their healing so I can go back and just get the lines fixed up a little bit. No biggie. So yeah, we got that. Um, I also, this is some, a stone that's new to me, so I had to pick one up just to kind of try and see what it's all about and perhaps wrap it for someone. This is red malachite. Really interesting. I really like green malachite. Please ignore my nails too. My gosh, I was playing with that uh, kinetic sand with my son earlier. I just noticed how awful that looks. Look. So yeah, apparently it has a very grounding, calming energy to it. And you can kind of, I kind of held it a little while yesterday and checked it out and it does. I feel very just peaceful when holding this one. So we got that one. And I also got a bunch of tectites. I love this cute little container they gave. So these are just black tectites, which is also a, um, they're just formed when a meteor um, comes in contact with the earth and the result of that creates this cool glassy um, tectite. So they're not a stone. And they're not actually like pieces of meteorite, but it's the result of the impact when the meteorite hits the earth, the heat and the chemicals in the area. So these are just some regular black tectites. Uh, Moldavite is a green tectite. And Libyan Desert Glass, which I don't have on me right now, but I do have some in my shop, is yellow. Actually, I have this one on me. And the Saphrodite is also pretty dark. Um, that one I haven't come across to create with. It was actually a gift. Um, I received when I purchased my first round of Moldavite uh, from a different shop than uh, Four Directions Magic, but I really like working with them because they're so local to me and they, they source some really cool stuff. So I'm 
I'm excited to be kind of, you know, supporting them at the same time. I also got a ton, probably six or seven, of obsidian arrowheads. I had these in the past and they go super, super, super quick. And when I purchase these, I order from like online. This is also a type of, it's not a tech type, but it's a type of glass similar to tech types. A volcanic glass, actually, this is. Anyways, so, and I had these before. They went super, super fast. So I have about six of them. They're all like a really good size. I was expecting smaller, but that's okay. I'm really happy with them. So I have about six of them. They're all slightly different because with crystals, you're never going to get two that are exactly the same. So I have a bunch of these. Excited to make this. And I'm thinking maybe some roach clips and wands with those two. Um, I like working with kyanite fans. So I got one of these. They only had one at the time. I probably would have bought a few. I really like these for roach clips. They just uh, remind me of like the tip of a broom, so it gives the roach clips kind of like a nice witchy vibe, which I like. And then what did I get? <clears throat> I purchased a couple moonstone tumbles. They're kind of like nice and square, so I might make a pair of earrings out of these actually. I think that'd be cute. They gave me some bonus crystals. I know for sure this one is blue um, calcite. Sorry, I couldn't think of the word for a second. The orange one, I'm not 100% sure. It could be orange calcite. And the green one, I'm going to have to ask them uh, what that is. I got some rough some rough gifts, and I think that's it. The, most th the thing I'm most excited about, obviously, is these moldavites. I got three more, so I'll be creating with these really, really soon. So keep an eye on my Facebook page and stuff. I haven't really been active on YouTube. Um, like I said, just a lot going on in my life. So trying to, you know, record a couple videos here and there whenever I have the chance, which doesn't happen as often as I would like. But, you know, being a mom to two special needs kids and, you know, life getting complicated every once in a while, things kind of take the back burner and sometimes that's my videos. So sorry about that. Um, anyways, I hope you have a great day and I hope you enjoyed this and I'll catch you on the next one. Bye.